everybody I'm ending my week a little bit late but without that many uh, digs by the way these are just all the crusty useless zincs I had so I'll I time I forget to announce that so I'll just push these over to the side and get them ready to be thrown away anyway I didn't I didn't get a chance to do a lot of digs uh, this week very very busy most of these like 35 45 minutes maybe as much as an hour hunt today was more like an hour hour and a half lots of uh, lots of things to do uh, and allergies to overcome uh, the rain in Texas finally went away and the the uh, wildflowers are in beautiful bloom and I am sick as a dog usually those two things uh, those two events sort of go hand in hand because I love allergies now people who love allergies don't hate flowers flowers hate us in any case uh here i go i'm gonna do a quick rundown and this is gonna be very very fast um i went out today with a combination of machines i didn't really track them i was just sort of running and gunning grabbing what was available but among other things there was the safari uh, and i bet you 90 percent of this was either with the safari or with the uh with the dais um, most of today was probably dais most of this day was probably the safari and various mixtures in between. I usually keep better track than that, but like I said, one of those running gun weeks, so so uh, so I have to throw myself on your mercy. And the first part of the week was just like a, a very short run with a with a, nice, with a pretty nice run of coins for such a short hunt, and that's uh, three quarters and a dime, four quarters and a dime, a buck. And then it's like a 35, 40 minute hunt, and that's another dime quarter. Uh, nickels and pennies. Always glad to see the nickels. Another short hunt. Uh, with just a dime here. And I believe this is also another dime. And the last couple of days, like 25 or 30 minute hunts, I got a, I don't know what to say, it's like a decorative, uh, you know, one of those, uh, I guess it would be, uh, oh, it's a knob off of something. Yeah, no biggie. That was just a quarter. Here's another penny. And uh, today was uh, one of my longer hunts of the week. But like I say, I'm just I'm just fighting to fighting to stay breathing. Uh, and uh, I got three quarters today. And a couple of ooh, that's a dime. Yep, a couple of dimes, which is not bad for this week of hunts, considering how short and abbreviated they were on in retrospect. And three more pennies. And this is a wheat penny my one saving grace so I do get a wheat uh, as uh, as Bob Zinga said woohoo so I did get a wheat and it's a 1957 I have to take my word for it it took me forever to get an angle where I could see the 57 and this of course this is the last it was the last year of the wheats and the last year before my birth so uh, and, and this falls in line with the other wheat pennies I've got in this area all of them seem to be clustered around the 50s. Not sure why, but every one I've gotten from that area has been in the 50s. But it's nice to get the wheat, so I'll just put that to the side. I always keep the wheats, you know, even if they are as crusty as this one is. And then I got a little uh, R, and this is actually an R, a little initial R. I'm not sure what it came off of, something uh, something with a name or with a, some initials on it. And the rest of this is just general junk uh, pieces for, I think that is uh, for a uh, window and various little pieces of chunks. Oh, another dime flew up in there. Oh, cool. Uh, pieces of uh, trash and uh, these little, uh, this little screw head or screw uh, nut. And those things just sound off beautifully. So that was it. So not a, not a great week. But, uh, you know, right now I'm on hand of histamines and getting... I've got I always got to tune myself for the uh, for the spring beauty uh, 225 yeah, about over three bucks Hell, it's not, yeah, it's not bad <laughs> for the for the amount of time I hunted and, uh, you know and the, the one little saving grace was of course the uh, the very 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 crusty uh, wheat penny anyway uh, that's all I've got and uh, I have been working on something here, and this, this this has been taking up some of my time when I've been in here hiding from the flowers. And I'm, I'm working on, and I'm still got it in pieces here. As you can see, I'm, I've done the ground balance mod, and I've actually got that done. I'm just working on setting up the switch for the for the all metal. So when I get that finished, you'll you'll find out about it. But right now, I just had to take a break. 
you know, after a while and you work on something, you get tired of it, and you have to put it off to the side, or you'll break it, or it'll break you. So, but you will see that, uh, you will see that upcoming in the future. And uh, so, that's about all I've got uh, for this uh, week's hunts. Uh, I, I did get a chance to get out, so I have a couple of digs that you will see that I have recorded with using a very, very small shovel that seemed to be very popular with everybody. The turning point shovel where I, where I dug a couple of, uh, of a pretty good, uh, pretty good little plugs considering the size of the shovel and the areas I was digging in. So you'll be seeing that in, a, in an upcoming video with a review of that turning point shovel. In any case, uh, this Texas Tiger digs with uh, not as bad a not as bad a three or three or four hour hunt than, than I thought. Could have been much better. And so, yep, I'm gonna be dropping down. I've got to drop down out of the uh, out of the burbs and into the uh, into some of the uh, area parks in the uh, northern the northern southern part of my area. See if I can find a few more good finds. Anyway, I'll be seeing you later, and you have a nice day.